Hello everyone. Today we'll learn about the properties and styling of the modal widget. A modal widget allows you to add dialog boxes to your app for user notifications, dialogs, lightboxes, and forms. You can also access the link to the documentation for this widget in the description below. Let's start with dropping the modal from the widget's inventory. Now to pop up the modal, we require to trigger an event. To do that, we'll use a button so let's drag and drop a button widget. Inspect the button to access its properties. Under the events accordion, click on add an event handler. Once done, we'll access the action property and select on show modal. Under action options, we've to choose the modal we dropped before. The event handler to view the modal is added successfully. Clicking on the button will show the modal. Let's quickly dive into its properties by inspecting our modal. Title. It is the header of the modal. We can name it as per the action our modal is performing. Let's say edit user details. Now click on the button to see our modal with the title we updated. Modal size. We have three different sizes available in our modal that are small, medium, and large. We can use these sizes as per the action we want to perform. For example, if we're going to show a notification, we can use small, and to add user form details, large or medium size can be used respectively. You can also programmatically set the modal by clicking on the FX button next to it. To add widgets like text and input fields in our modal, we have to trigger the modal by clicking on the button, then drag and drop widgets from the widget's inventory. Let's try it out. I am dropping a text input field on it. As per your UI, you can create your form to take user inputs like this. We won't be covering the tooltip as this property will be removed from the modal widget. Layout. Toggle on or off to display the widget in desktop and mobile view. You can programmatically determine the value by clicking on FX to set a Boolean value. Now let's explore the styling of the modal widget. Currently, we only have the following property under styles. You can always visit the documentation page to learn about the newly introduced features. Disable. Toggle it on to lock the widget, it'll become non-functional. You can programmatically set the Boolean value by clicking on the FX button. Our final modal will look like this. I hope you found this video informative. Thank you for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe to our channel for the latest updates.